Hello and welcome to Abundant Life Christian Center Church Service Online. We are so happy to have you. Please share this link with your friends and your family so they can all take in on this experience of faith, favor, and of fellowship. Enjoy the service. God is a man of war. Hallelujah, man of war. God is a man of war. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. God is a man of war. Hallelujah, man of war. God is a man of war. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Exodus 15, 3 says, The Lord is a warrior. The Lord is his name. Glory be to the name of the Almighty God. We want to give God the glory for seeing us through this week. What a great God we serve. What a wonderful God we serve. What a powerful God we serve. Manifesting himself in miracles, signs and wonders in our lives. Opening doors, opening doors, opening doors to high places of life. I am telling you, I'm pronouncing it upon you. God is opening doors. He's opening doors. He's taking you higher and higher. He's going to fill your life with pleasant surprises by the authority in the name of Jesus. Father, we give you praise. Welcome to winning hour of prayers. Everybody, the Lord bless you out there. I celebrate each and every one of you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless your families. God bless everyone connected to you. Quick, let's begin to pray from that song you will know tonight. It's fire for fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, we are not joking. We don't joke every time we come. We, every time we come, we come to call upon the Lord. We come to call upon the Lord to help us to have mercy, to help us to intercede, to help us to intervene in our lives and in the lives of our loved ones. I want you, and God has been faithful. He has been faithful to you. He has been faithful to me. He's faithful. That's why we are alive. So I want you where you are, begin to have appreciate God, begin to thank God. Psalms 136, you can read it later, 1 to 26. Verse 1 says, give thanks to the Lord for God is good. Hey, we can just stop right there. And on that basis, let's begin to thank him. God is a good God. God is a good God. When somebody is good, they do good things. God is a good God. Everything good in your life came from the Lord. Everything good in your life came from the Lord. Begin to appreciate God. Begin to thank God right now. It is Okay, it is comely, it is right, it is proper for us to appreciate him. Lord God, we give you praise. My Lord and my God, God, the man of war. Lord God, we thank you. My Lord and my God, I have come to say thank you. Thank you, Lord God, on behalf of myself, on behalf of my family. Thank you, Lord God, for your providence. Thank you, Lord God, for your care. Thank you, Lord God, for your provisions. Thank you, Lord God, for your protection. Thank you that you did not, Lord God, definitely can allow the waters of life to, Lord God, sweep us away. Continue to thank God. Thank him for his mercies. Thank God for his grace upon your life. Everyone has grace. The Bible says of the grace upon Jesus, we have received grace to grace, increase to increase. Continue to thank God for the increase in your life. Continue to thank God for his protection. Continue to thank God for helping you throughout this week. Continue to thank God you went, you, you were out, you went all over the places. The Lord kept you. Hey, David said, I slept, Proverbs, uh, Psalms 3, 5. I slept and I woke. It was the Lord that sustained me. Hey, that man knew that there was no way he could wake up without God waking him up. You know that. I know that. So continue to thank Thank God for his sustaining power over our lives. We slept last night. We woke up. We went all over the places. And he's keeping us. He's keeping us through the year already this month. Begin to thank God. Continue to thank him. Thank him for his kindness. Thank him for his faithfulness. Thank him for his goodness. By the authority in the name of Jesus, it shall be so. As you are thanking him, you know the blessings of thanksgiving. It is proper. It is comely to, to give thanks. As you are giving thanks, chains are be broken in your life as you are giving thanks multiplication of the little things that are good in your life as you are thanking God every chain holding you breaks right now chain of addition to aqua breaks right now chain of addition to food breaks right now every addiction chain let it break let it break let it break it breaks over your life pornography addiction breaks that chain breaks that chain breaks that chain breaks
this I am hearing of we, 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 we smoking we, marijuana, that addition breaks. I know some people are saying it's medication. If it's medication for you, okay, but for those you don't want it, you don't need it, uh, that addition breaks. It breaks, it breaks. Every old, everything that has been a strong gold, whatever is having a strong gold over your life that you cannot control yourself, that addition breaks, that chain breaks, that old breaks, that old is rendered powerless. Burdens are being lifted right now. Burdens are over your marriage. Is, they are being lifted right now. Burdens over your children, over your grandchildren. You are burdened down because of your health. You are worried. I speak to you, woman of God. In the name of Jesus, you are healed. In the name of Jesus, you are healed. Let the blood of Jesus flow through you right now. In the name of Jesus, I decree healing in your homes. I decree healing over your finances. I decree healing over everything that pertains to you. In the mighty name of Jesus, you have not come to see man. We have all come to the win-win link. We have all come to our mighty God we have not we are all we all of us we have come to the Lord the living God God will change your deficit he will change your deficit into surplus you have come to him you are winning that 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 court case you are winning it in the name of Jesus you have come to the city of the living God you have come to the win-win station you have come to the win-win link where nobody loses everyone wins because of the almighty God that we have Seven, your joy will be full for joining this day. Say amen in the name of Jesus. Your peace will be like a river this day. You have come to Mount Zion. You will possess your possessions. Your portion is breakthrough. Your portion is healing. Receive it. Your portion is peace. Receive it. Your portion is abundance and wealth and wellness. Receive it. Receive the declarations. Receive the blessings of the Lord. Receive peace flowing like a river. Receive the joy of the Almighty God. Let there be a turning. Let there be a turning. He said, When the Lord shall turn again, the captivity of Zion, let every captivity turn right now in the name of Jesus. Where you are, let's ask God for mercy. Let's ask God for mercy. Proverbs 14 34. He says, Righteousness exalts a nation, but sin is a disgrace to any people. Ah, sin is a reproach. Sin is a disgrace. Sin is a weakness. Sin is a mocker of destiny. Sin can hinder prayers. Sin condemns. God does not want you to be condemned no matter what you have done. God does not want your prayers in that and sin can hinder prayers. So let's call upon the Lord. We serve a good God. We have just read that he's a God of mercies he said come he's not saying he said come even if your sins if they are red as scarlet he said he will make them to be white as snow he's just making that invitation let's go to him let's ask God for mercy father in the name of Jesus Lord God forgive me ask God for forgiveness forgive us Lord God heavenly king of trespasses forgive us of our sins Lord God I want you confess no sin no sin confess it to the Lord confess it ask him to have mercy Ask him to help you to overcome sins and shortcomings of life. Ask him that whatever can hinder your prayers. You know what can hinder your prayers. I know what can hinder my prayers. Let us call upon the Lord. Oh Lord, have mercy, oh Lord. Have mercy upon us. Have mercy upon us. Have mercy upon us. Lord God, cleanse us of all wrongdoings. Cleanse us from everything, Lord God, that is not of you. In the name of Jesus, whatsoever is not in conformity with your will. In our lives, Father, Lord God, heavenly King, we give you permission. Give God permission to uproot everything that is not of His in your life. Give God permission to uproot that that wickedness, that that tit for tat spirit, that anger. Give God the opportunity. Tell Him, Lord, I release it to you. Help me, help me, help me. Take away this spirit of anger. Take away everything that is too strong for you to 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 take care of. Father, Lord God, heavenly King, we thank you. Thank you for forgiving us. Thank you because you said there is no one that will come to you that you will cast off. Thank you, Lord God, that we all have been received by you tonight. Father, we worship you. We give you glory. We give you honor. In Jesus' name we pray. Listen, we are depending more and more on the Holy Spirit. Let's learn to do that every day. Cultivate a relationship with the Holy Spirit every day. Be intimate with him. Because not by mind, not by power, but by the Spirit of the almighty God whatever you want to do in your own strength cannot last long you may kick off but it will not end well but when you depend on the Holy Spirit every day you depend upon him for everything God is going to help you I want you where you are 
Let's depend on the Holy Spirit. As that's what the early church, that was what they did. Acts 13 too. It says why they were worshipping. The Lord, uh, while they were worshipping and fasting, the Holy Spirit said, set apart. The, why they were worshipping the Lord. They were sent by the Holy Spirit in Acts 13.4. They did not do anything uh, except the Holy Spirit said so. And that is the way we should live. They were sent by the Holy Spirit. They were directed by the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit forbade them from preaching even at a time. Are you kidding me? He did not let them preach because there was danger. So it is not always when God closes a door that it's a bad door that somebody closes. No, God sometimes, he closes bad doors. He doesn't want evil to occur to you. We are going to pray, say, my father, my father, my father, I commit myself. I commit, Lord God, heavenly king, the remaining months, Lord God, into your hand. I commit the year into your hand. Father, as you instructed the early church, you led them, you performed miracles through them, you instructed them where to go and where not to go. Father, Lord God, the remaining month and Lord God, throughout this year, Father, Lord God, I am praying in Jesus' name. Lead me, guide me. Father, as I'm praying for myself, I'm praying for my loved ones, I'm praying for my spouse, I'm praying for my children, I'm praying for grandchildren. Pray for yourself, pray for your loved ones. Let us call upon the Lord, the Lord God, Heavenly King, throughout this month, throughout the year, lead us, guide me, O oh Lord, instruct me, enable me, energize me, my Father. I depend upon you for everything, O oh Lord. Energize me, strengthen me, anoint me, empower me for everything I need to do in the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Jehovah. O oh Lord, my God, I release my life. Continue to release your life and everything bothering me, whatsoever is bothering you. Release it to the Lord. Father, Lord God, I release. Lord God, heavenly king, everything annoying you, release to the Lord. Everything frustrating you, release to the Lord. Everything of your life, roll over to the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit of the Almighty God, thank you, mighty Jehovah. Thank you, Lord God. We give you permission to, Lord God, help us to pray. You are helping us already, and we say thank you. We give you permission, Lord God, for everything throughout this month, throughout, Lord God, this year, that you, Lord God, help us to be sensitive to you. Pray that the Lord will anoint your ears. Father, anoint our ears to hear your word distinctly, to hear your voice distinctly, to know when you are talking to us, or when, Lord God, events or situations are talking to us have your way in our lives oh lord father lord god anoint our ears anoint our minds in the name of jesus lord god heavenly king father we give you praise lord we give you glory lord we give you honor in jesus name we pray i pray for you because you are leaning upon the holy spirit the holy spirit will begin to guide you he will begin to direct you you will not be led by your feelings you will not be led by wrong people you will not be led by circumstances you shall be led by the Holy Spirit after the order of Acts chapter 13 verse 22 the Lord testified of David that he was a man after his own heart a man who will do everything that God wants him to do so shall be your testimony the Lord will testify about you people will testify about you but they will testify you will be there they will say wow you have done this for me you have done that for me and you will say to God be all the glory so God be all the glory for in ourselves we cannot do anything good so God be all the glory I I want you even where you are, where you are, begin to say to God be the glory, to God be the glory for the good things in my life, to God be the glory, Lord God, for the good things, Lord God, that I can do, to God be all the glory, to God be all the honor, in Jesus' name we pray. Listen, I was singing the other time, God is a man of war, hallelujah, man of war, God is a man of war. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. We are going to cancel all evils. We are going to cancel negative things said against you, evil expectations of people against you, evil pronouncements, evil dreams. We are going to cancel. We are going to destroy. We are going to decree fire of God to come upon everything that is not of, the, uh, of God in the name of Jesus. I want you to start praying. I stand upon the authority given to me by the Lord. 
in Matthew 15, 13, Lord God, I stand by that authority. Masike nerebo sakanda. Whatsoever God has not ordered cannot be delivered in my life. Whatsoever God has not ordered cannot be delivered upon my children. Whatsoever God has not ordered cannot be delivered into this family. Masike nerebo shakanda. Arabasuke nerebo sakanda. Begin to continue to pray, continue to pray. I'm going to explain to us later, but I want you to say in Jesus' name, Benoni order. After the order of Genesis 35, 18, you call this a Benoni order. I refuse you. I, receive, I refuse this evil order. I uproot this evil from the root. Evil order of failure, I uproot from the root. Begin to uproot. Begin to uproot. Every evil order, whatsoever you think is plaguing you, you know it. We know it when things are not right. Begin to take authority. Take dominion over it. Take charge. Take authority. Exercise the authority of God over it. I uproot you in the name of Jesus. Evil order of sickness, I uproot you from the root based upon the word of God. Evil order of late achievement, I uproot you by the authority in the name of Jesus. I uproot everything that is not of God. My God has not ordered it. He cannot be delivered. It is a Benoni order. It cannot be delivered over me. Negativity cannot be delivered over me. Sickness cannot be delivered. Evil, your evil expectation, I cancel. It shall not be delivered. It's a Benoni order. I reject it. I rebuke it. I refute it in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. We are warming up. We are warming up. Lamentations 337. He said, who is he who speaks and it comes to pass when the Lord has not commanded it? The Bible is saying, who is that person wishing you evil? Who is that person commanding negativity? Who is that person not wishing you well? He said, God has not ordered it. They may wish it, but it cannot come to pass because God has not ordered it. Who is he who speaks and it comes to pass? It cannot come to pass when the Lord has not commanded it. Hey, sweet, say the Lord has not commanded evil over me. It shall not happen. The Lord has not commanded death over me. It shall not happen. The Lord has not commanded failure concerning me. It shall not happen. Shout, write it. My God has not ordered it. My God has not ordered that evil concerning me. It will not come to pass. It does not matter the negative things the enemy is telling you. You will die. I want you to refute it with the words of God coming from your mouth. Say after the order of Lamentations 3, 37. My God has not ordered it. It shall not come to pass. My God has not commanded it. It shall not come to pass by the authority in the name of Jesus. Say it, write it. God did not order it. It's a Benoni order. A greater than Jacob. God said it shall not be so. It shall not be so. It will not come to pass. The order is overruled. Every evil order is overruled. Every evil order, evil order of cancer is overruled. Evil order of premature death is overruled. Evil order of failure at the age of success is overruled. Evil order, evil pronouncement that you will not be married. It is overruled by the authority in the name of Jesus. I am hearing evil order, whatever concussion they have given you to eat, they are giving you to drink, that you will not carry your baby. Hey, tonight in Jesus' name, begin to throw up, begin to throw up. Let the Holy Spirit get it out of your system right now in the name of Jesus. It's a Benoni order, it cannot stay. Hallelujah. Let me quickly explain. In Genesis 35, 518. The Bible says, As her soul was departing, she died. She named him Benoni, son of my sorrow. That same verse 18. I was even thinking, oh, maybe it will be verse 19. But right there, as the woman, mother of the child, pronouncing that, oh, this is this is a son of sorrow. The father rose up that hey, it shall not be so according to my general overseer, Dr. Festus. It shall not be so. The father said, No, 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 no. I am cancelling that order. That is not the order. I am the father. That is not my order. The order, his name is Benjamin, the son of my right hand. The right hand is a hand of power. It's, it's a hand of honor. He's a son of my right hand. 
the man the fire for fire yeah, 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 yeah. fire yeah, 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 yeah. you cannot name this benoni i reject it i refute it no i change it from benoni to benjamin it may start with b but it's different one is sorrow one is power hallelujah i have been sent by the almighty god the i am that i am the God of chaos, they say, the Elohim, ha, he has sent me to tell you that a greater than Jacob, your father, your father is standing beside you today, your father is in agreement with you today, the Bible says when two shall agree, it shall be done for them, God is agreeing with you, I am agreeing with you, we are agreeing with one another, God, our heavenly father, not Jacob now, a greater than Jacob, a greater than our parent, he is here to refute, to cancel, all negative, all Orders, oh Benoni orders, Mazakandarabasi Kende Rebo Shakandarabasi Kende. Ah, God, we cancel tonight in the name of Jesus. The last time I checked, your father's will, they will name the Bible. Lamentation 337. Look at this version. He says, No one can say something and make it happen. Unless the Lord orders it. Hey, did you hear that? No one, no mother, no father, no caregiver, no whoever, no supervisor can say something and make it happen. Hallelujah. They may say it, they cannot make it happen. Are you ready to fire? Are you ready to fire? Say, my Lord and my God, I stand upon the authority of the word of God based upon Lamentations 337. Who is he who speaks and it comes to pass when the Lord does not commanded it so i cancel this day in agreement with my brethren we are praying together we cancel i cancel this day every evil thought evil wish evil pronouncement evil conclusion evil arrangement i cancel evil dreams it's a benoni dream it's a benoni dream it shall not come to pass it's a benoni dream it's a benoni talk that talk that word is benoni hey is abasukanda it is benzoid benzoid acid is not even good it is a benoni we cancel it in in the name of Jesus, that evil, evil order of death, evil order of failure, evil order of, of accident, it's a Benoni one. We cancel it in Jesus' name. We break every voodoo, every jinx, every spell. We cancel right now. It shall never happen. It shall never happen. After the order of Genesis 35, 18b, it shall never happen. The Lord said, Benoni, pack your load and go. Benoni of failure, pack your load and go. Everything, every word, actually of parent caregivers negative Lord God contrary to the word of God it's a Benoni order we command pack your load go Benoni against my marriage pack your load and leave my second shanda. every Benoni word said over my life representing Benoni representing frustration of other frustrations of other people's lives having expressions over my life your tenancy is over by the authority in the name of Jesus, your tenancy is over. Your in this family, your tenancy is over. Your tenancy is over. Benoni, pack your load and go in the name of Jesus. Benoni from my mother's family, pack your load and go. Benoni from uh, my father, Benoni from teachers, Benoni from caregivers, pack your load and go in the name of Jesus. Water, Lord God, every king that I, I, I took, I drank, represented Benoni, pack your load and go leave my body leave my body pray and decree over yourself pray and decree healing of god pray and decree healing of god fold your hands around your waist or you punch or you lay your hands upon your head i decree wellness i decree wholeness upon me in jesus name by the stripes of jesus i am healed i am healed your eyes are healed in the name of jesus my second shakana every tingly tingly negative yeah you are healed you are healed you are healed of every every sickness there are tragedies go you are benoni go in the name of jesus High blood pressure, you are a Benoni. Go. Pray for anything, anyone connected to you. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, I stand in my office. Hey, Masikenda If I be a child of God, we are children of God. Let's stand upon that authority. Let's stand upon that power. In the name of Jesus, I stand in my office as a child of God by the Spirit of the Almighty God living inside of me. Hey, you are praying, you are praying pray because you're a child of God. You are standing in that office tonight. You are standing in that office. Let's rebuke. Let's reject. Say, I rebuke every Benoni order. Ha! 
I rebuke every Benoni order over my children. I rebuke every Benoni order over my spouse. I rebuke, hey, Masikenga Boshanda. Yes, rebuke it. Nullify it. Rebuke every Benoni order concerning your womb. Rebuke every Benoni order concerning your marriage. Rebuke every Benoni order concerning that child. That child is a gift from God. You will not weep over that child. You will not be frustrated over that child. You cannot be harassed over that child. She's not a Benoni. She is a blessing from the Almighty God. Patternize and rebuke all Benoni orders over your business. Over your business, your business will not go down. It shall never happen. The Lord did not command it. Your business will not go down. I decree a turn around over that business. I decree resources to begin to flow. I decree for clients or whatsoever you say. Let nations come to it. Let the Lord advertise your business. The Lord will advertise you for coming online to pray. The Lord will advertise that business. The Lord will advertise whatsoever you carry. I want you to decree the things that will not come to pass. Take authority. You are standing in the authority, in your office as a child of God. I want you to decree the things that will not come to pass. The wish of failure, the wish of sicknesses, the wish of death, every wish of destruction, demotion, doom over my family will never come to pass. I decree that in Jesus' name this year, every evil thought, evil expectation, evil pronouncement over me, over my spouse, over over my children, grandchildren, over my family, over the work of God and the people of God in our hand. I cancel. It shall not come to pass. It shall not come to pass. By the authority in the name of Jesus, the Bible says, Isaiah 54, no weapon fashioned against us will prosper. The, God said it did not. They can gather. They can gather all they want, but their Benoni orders will not come to pass. Their Benoni orders will not come to pass over my life. Benoni orders will not come to pass over my family. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. It is not just that evil will not come to pass. Somebody has to pay for it. Somebody ordered it. They have to pray for it. Who dares wake up? Wake, the Bible says, who dares wake up a lion? Hey, since you started this, the secular has to be commanded. You, you don't understand what I'm saying? We were just on our own and they troubled you. They troubled me. The Bible is saying somebody started it. The God will pay for it. They're not just going to go. They will not go scot-free. It's paid day for the wicked. Genesis 49, 49. The circle must be completed. Uh, my prayer slingers out there. Are uh, the prayer warriors ready to fire? Let me quickly explain them. We pray. Numbers 23, 24. He said, Behold the people rises up like a lioness. Wow. And lifts itself up like a lion. Did you see that? He said, it, it will not lie down. Hey, the lion will not lie down. The lion will not rest until he devours the prey and drinks the blood of the slain. Did you see that? He rose up, started like a lioness, but when he rose up, lifted up himself like a lion. Hey, we are Jesus is the lion of the tribe of Judah. Lions don't give back to chickens. Lions give back to lions. He said, hey, you mess up with me by waking me. By waking me up with your wickedness. I'm a lion. That's what he said. He said, hey, now we are going to bring up the lion uh, uh, part of us. We are going to bring that lioness that started like a lioness, but now rose up like a lion. Lions don't stop. They don't look away. After you have messed with them, verse 24, he said, it will not lie down. It will not back off until it devours the prey. He said, and drinks the blood of the slave. Lion, lion in, the, in the wild will drink the blood. We are not here to drink blood. No, 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 no. But we are here to go after their whatsoever, whatsoever has troubled us. We are here to go after them and slay them and to cause them to drink their own blood. We are not drinking blood. They are drinking their own blood. My second Shanda, shout and write. Evil people, you initiate, since you started this, since you initiated it. So come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's see who we win. My God is with me. You are coming with me in the name of voodoo. I come against you in the name of the Almighty God. No more peace for the wicked. Hey, before we pray, one more scriptures. Daniel 6 24. Some people ordered evil for Daniel. Daniel uh, chapter 6, verses 7 to 8. You can write it later. Uh, eventually, they threw that young man, they threw him in the in the lion's den but guess what my general overseer dr Fessus, he always says when lions meet lions they just walk their tears hallelujah they threw this young man
Not knowing that it's God, who is the lion of the tribe of Judah. They threw him into the lion's den. But lions, when lions meet lions, Daniel, he was a son, he was the son of God, the son of the lion of the tribe of Judah. So when lions meet lions, they would just praise the Lord. They was just praising the Lord. The Lord preserved his life. Hallelujah. Hey, Master came there about Shanda, but this is where I'm going so that we can pray. When the king saw that they were, the lions couldn't hurt uh, Daniel, the king then gave a command, a command, verse 24. And those men who had maliciously accused Daniel, the, the king just didn't let them go free. He said they were brought and thrown into the den of lions. They, their children and their wives. And before they reached the bottom of the den, the lions overpowered them. Arima Sukanda and crushed their bones. In the Rebo Sokondorobo Shanda. This year, all the others, hey, roll your amen with fire, receive it with faith. Hey, all the others against you, burn into ashes. No Benoni songs in your family. No evil gatherings in your family. God will be a wall of fire around each and every one of us. God will burn off anyone, anything coming at us in the name of Jesus. After the order of Daniel 6, 24, as those who threw, who threw and ordered against Daniel, they ordered that evil order against Daniel as they were thrown into the lion, lion's den. I command back to sender. I command back to sender. Say amen. Back to all the senders, all evil wishes, evil expectations, whatever is the evil wish against your life. We go back a thousand fold upon the wicked in the name of Jesus. My second shaka. You must pray this with all seriousness. You must pray this every day if you have to. Hey, I want you to say you ordered it, you pay for it. You ordered the evil, you're going to pay for it. I am not paying for evil. My father is a good God. He's building me to be good. You order the evil. It goes back upon you a thousand fold in the name of Jesus. If they ordered it, let them pay for it. Harima Sukada, because if God did not order it, he doesn't order evil for his children. Then somebody did. Let that somebody pay. Let that somebody pay for it by the authority in the name of Jesus. That person must pay for it. They must pay for it. Are you ready to fire? Are my prayer slingers out there? Are the warriors ready? Say, oh Lord Jehovah. Oh Lord Jehovah, oh Lord Jehovah, my father, my father, my father, the mighty man in battle, by your authority, this day, this night, this minute, this hour, this second, I decree back to senders, all evil orders against me, all evil orders against my family, against my career, against my business, hey Rabbi Sakanda, pray, 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 patronize the prayer and pray in the name of Jesus, it's a Benoni we cancel, say my father, my father, my Father, based upon your word, Isaiah 3, 11, disaster and doom to the wicked. Everything they did will be done to them. Every stone they have rolled at me, let them pay for it. Every voodoo goes back upon them. Every harassment goes back upon them. Every affliction goes back upon them. My yes, they have wasted my sick and shanda for making me to cry. My God, avenge for me. Hey, they must pay for it. For troubling my children. For delaying my children. They must pay for it. I I raise a war cry against them tonight. I raise a war cry against anyone troubling my family. I raise a war cry against anyone troubling the people of God in our hands. I decree fire for fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fire for fire, yeah, 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 yeah. Fire for fire, yeah, 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 yeah. Irama Sikene, a thousand fold returns upon the wicked in the name of Jesus. Masikenderebo Sakanda Rabashakanda Rabasanda. You are going to pray with power and fervency. We are using Proverbs 14 19. He said, Evil we bow down before the good, and the wicked we bow at the gate of the righteous. Say, My father, my father, my father, based upon your word, evil must bow down before good, the wicked must bow at the gate of the righteous. As the brothers of Joseph bowed, we are praying as they bowed down to him. Genesis 42 says, they came and bowed down with their faces to the ground. Everyone who has done evil against
against me, against my family, against uh, my friends online with me tonight. They must bow to the name of Jesus. They will bow. I don't know what it is in Jesus. They will pray and decree. I'm decreeing over your life. I decree and I declare. Evil must bow. Voodoo must bow for you. Sickness must bow for you. Wickedness must bow for you. Poverty must bow for you. Say amen. Failure must bow for you. I am hearing hatred must bow for you. That persecution will not last long. You are going through persecution. It will God said to tell you it will not last long. God is working on it concerning you. Irabasuka and I will bow for you. Every harassment bows in the name of Jesus. Master Kende Rebo Shanda. Psalm 70 verse 3. He said let them be turned back because of their shame and disgrace. Those who say aha, aha, aha. Hey. Everyone who has mocked you will pay for it. Say amen. Everyone who has troubled you will pay for it. Those who have said that, ha, ha, laughed at you because of the negativity that happened to you, it, they will pay for it. They will be met with shame and disgrace. Everyone who has said, where is your God? They will see the finger of your God walking against them in the name of Jesus. The Bible says in Jesus' name. The Bible says, Psalms 138 verse 8, the Lord will perfect everything that concerns me. The Lord will accomplish everything that that concerns me. God is going to accomplish. I don't know what you want from God. God is going to accomplish for you. God is a perfecter. He will perfect your life. He will perfect your family. He will perfect your health. We are going to pray. I want you to pray where you are. Hey, Masikendere Shakana, call upon the God. Say, oh God of perfection. Oh God of perfection. Lord God, perfect all that pertains to me. Perfect my health. Perfect my family. Perfect my business. Perfect my children. Perfect my career. I don't know what you want from God to perfect. I want you to customize that prayer. Patternize it to yourself. I pronounce blessings upon your life. Whatever you want perfected shall be perfected. Incompleteness shall be completed. Impossibilities, what the lawyers have said, it's impossible. What the doctors could not do, all the impossibilities, irabasikanda, become possible. In the name of Jesus, let there be a turn around. Let there be a turn. Let there be a turn. Let there be a turn. Let there be a turn in your favor by the authority in the name of Jesus. God will perfect all that pertains to you. Please, wherever you are, we are rounding up Jeremiah 13 then he says as the waistband clings to the body of the wearer so God will cause you not just the house of Israel to be wrapped around you uh, to be wrapped around him say oh Lord my God let's call upon the Lord I want us to know God deeper to walk with God deeper God is so good he's so faithful he's so kind he's so merciful he's not someone we should just do in and out we we need to cling to him we need to lean upon him and if we don't ask him God it is the amount of space you give God that he will, he will, he will accept for you. Say oh Lord my father after the order of Gen uh, Jeremiah 13 11, Lord God please cause me and my children no matter how young they are present them to the Lord they can know the Lord Lord please cause me my household to cling to you as the waistband as the girdle cling to the body of the wearer cause me cause my family Lord God that my friends pray with me Lord God every link to Tonight, cause us, Lord God, every one of us to cling to you. You are the source of life. Father, you are the source of life. Please take away from us those, Lord God, heavenly king we have made as gods in our lives. They are seasons. They cannot hold water. We are the one. God is the one. He is the well of living waters. We are clinging to you. Take away the things we have been clinging on. We want to cling to you, O oh Lord. We want to know you more and more this year. We want our children to know you. We want to grow deeper in love with you lord please make me a people make me a name make me a praise make me a glory oh lord everywhere lord god heavenly king that i will go father lord god make me a name oh lord for you make me a praise for you make me a person a people for you make me a glory for you pray that prayer for your family for your business for god to make your business a name a praise and a glory in the name of jesus in jesus name we pray as we are rounding up the bible says proverbs 10 24 Four, verse 24 B but the desire of the righteous will be granted I want you where you are since I'm going to declare next to you whatsoever you want I want you to pray whatsoever is your desire the Bible says the desire of the righteous shall be granted wherever you are pray that for yourself pray that patronize it pray your desires God said if, we, if the desires of the righteous shall be granted your desire to carry your baby shall be granted your desire over your children shall be granted it does 
no matter what you are saying now, all your desires, your godly desires shall be granted in Jesus' name. Wherever you are, I want your prayers and your amen to roll like rivers of water. Your fire branded amen. Receive this pronouncement by the authority in the name of Jesus. Receive them by faith. Receive them by faith. You will see them come to pass. Let your amen, let it roar like thunder. Let your amen be fire branded. Let your amen roll like the speed of light in the name of Jesus. After the order, I'm taking everything, no matter the time, whatsoever point I can take, I will pronounce it upon you. The Lord who gave me this, he will bring them to pass in your life. I'm using Job 29. After the order of Job, Job was demarcated with glory. I pray for you. God's distinguished glory will demarcate you. God's glory will be a canopy over you. God's glory will be a canopy over you. His presence will envelop you. You will stand out with honor. Say amen. You will stand out with favor everywhere you go. The Lord will watch you as the apples of his eyes. God will carry you. As the eagle carries the eaglet in the name of Jesus. Because you came to pray. Number two. I pray the blessings of better days are ahead for you. Your good days, they are not behind you. Better days, your best days are yet to come. They are in front of you and you are stepping into your best days. Some you have just stepped into your best days. I decree on like Job, your own best days are not behind you. They are ahead of you. Your days and your years will get better. Your days and your years will get bigger. Your days and your years will get brighter. You will move from best to best. You will move from best to glory. You will move from glory to glory because you came to pray. Blessings of beautiful life and wealth. Job's path was drenched with cream. Hey. Did you hear that? Joe's path was drenched with cream. Your part in life shall be beautiful and smooth. Say amen. Your part in life, your part in your career, the part you are taking, it shall be beautiful and smooth. By the authority in the name of Jesus, your part will be drenched with cream. Things will be smooth for you this week. Every lump and difficulty is removed from your part. Every lump and difficulty is removed from your offices, from your business, from your school, from your career. Your part will drench. It will drench. It will be smooth. As the rock poured out for Job streams of olive oil. The rocks will pour out streams of olive oil for you. Multiple streams of income are decreased. Let doors open up. Let doors open up. Let doors I'm hearing. Let the Lord God is connecting you. He's bringing a pass of destinies. Those who will make your destinies to shine brighter. God is connecting you with them. Abundance of good things over your life. Open doors to greater doors of opportunities. You will suck on it from the rock. Where others are finding things difficult you will suck honey from me things will be easy for you because you came to pray blessings of friendship and leadership over you after the order of verses 7 to 11 as job sat at the top of his time you will sit in high places you will go far by the authority in the name of jesus you will get to the highest places of your career you will not be a mediocre god will fly you there whatsoever is your dear wheresoever is your dear god will take you there aside for you. People will step aside for you. People of honor, they will step aside for you. Hey, God has just brought you into limelight. God is taking some into limelight. People will step aside for you because you are a child of God, not because of yourself. You carry grace. You carry authority. Older people will rise to salute and respect the grace you carry. Leaders of groups and organizations will be quiet for you to speak. The words coming out of your mouth will be seasoned with grace because you came to pray. Your good work will be acknowledged and rewarded after the order of verse 12 money in abundance wisdom in abundance grace in abundance grace is favor grace is anointing grace is power i decree grace in abundance whatsoever you do even in your family for every member grace in abundance Grace in abundance for your job in the name of Jesus. Connections will lift you up and others in abundance because you came to pray. Blessings of longevity upon you after the order of verse 18. Your days will be numerous as the grains of the sea. You will live long. I will live long. Your years on earth shall be as numerous as the grains of sand. You will live. You will live. You will not die. We shall live. We will not 
not die. By the authority in the name of Jesus, your life is a show and demonstration, a show of God's glory, a show of God's wealth, a show of God's power. Your family, your children, your career is a show, it's a demonstration of God's power, it's a demonstration of God's glory, it's a show, it's a show. Your life is a show and demonstration of God's glory, God's wealth, God's power, God's favor in the name of Jesus because you came to pray. I pray the blessings of stability after the other verse 19 upon your life. Your roots will reach deep into the waters. The dew will settle upon your branches all day. Say boldly, hey Rabbi Sikanda, my roots will reach down to the water. The dew of heaven will lie upon my life. It will lie upon my spouse, upon my children, upon my finances. I decree over your life. The root of your destiny will reach down deep into waters. The dew will be upon your life all day, all night. There shall be no dryness in your life. Nothing will move you from your place of glory and destiny in the name of Jesus. God himself shall be the dew upon your life. He shall be the dew upon everything connected to you. Your glory will not be hidden. Your glory will not fade by the authority in the name of Jesus. Emblem of power or authority. Always it will be in your hand by the authority in the name of Jesus, because you came to pray. Lastly, blessings of power and influence. After the order of verses 20 to 23, people listen to Job's words. I declare and declare over your life. Your words will carry weight. Your words will carry grace. Your words will carry power. Your words will be honored. But you and be celebrated in the name of Jesus. All oh, we love you, all oh, we celebrate you because of the presence of your God. People will be drawn to you as bees are drawn to honey. People will be drawn to what you carry. People will be drawn to who you are. They will be drawn to your person. They will be drawn to your career. They will be drawn to your family in the name of Jesus. Honor and favor follow you in the name of Jesus. Whatever is your career, your business, or your calling, you will sit as a chief among others. You will be as king or queen among the troops. In the name of Jesus, all these blessings plus more will come upon your head and God will drench you with the uncommon, unquantifiable, and undeniable treasures of his presence. So shall it be, so must it be. The seal of the Almighty God is upon it and no one can refute it. No one can reverse it because this is what the Lord has commanded. The Lord has commanded blessings upon you. These are the things the Lord has commanded and they will surely come to pass by the authority in the name of Jesus. So God be all the glory, the good things he has done. Let's thank God where you are. He's the one who enabled us to pray. Let's appreciate God. Father, we thank you. We give you praise. We give you glory. Thank you, Lord God, for strengthening us to pray. Thank you, Lord God, for helping us. Thank you, Lord God, heavenly king, that the couriers of heavens, the angels, they are, Lord God, already moving around to give us, Lord God, answers to our prayers. And we thank you, Daddy, that there is no hindrance. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty God. Yamasu Kenderebo Shanda. All is well with all of us. All is well with you. Thank you for coming to pray with me tonight or today or whenever you are praying in or you, whenever you come to pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Quick three services. Don't forget tomorrow. Don't miss it. 8 o'clock on site, 10 15 on site and online. And our young adult service, my goodness, is growing like fire. Tell your young ones, the youth, your younger, your young adults, your older adults, they must not miss it. Twelve fifteen or twelve thirty or so every Sunday. I don't. I'm not sure of the time. I'm not. They don't allow young people like us. Hallelujah. I think it's twelve thirty. Twelve thirty. Please tell everyone you know with children, not just children and young adults after college. Yeah, they are just they don't want to serve God, but when they come, the anointing of God will arrest them and cling them to the Lord. That is what we want. We want the next generations to serve the Lord, to spread the gospel all over the world. And so shall it be for all of us in Jesus' name. Remember, it is not over until you win, because all things work together. For those who love the Lord, because you love the Lord, it shall turn in your favor in the name of Jesus. It is not over until you win. So shall it be. I love you. God bless all of you. Thank you for coming to pray. I love you. Shalom. Shalom.